day. Good recovery, really good recovery. Toyota really seemed to be the class of the field. Did you feel like you had made gains in this car at Phoenix from last fall? Yeah, I think that, you know, everybody at JGR and Toyota, uh, you know, with the two cars, they just did a great job. So uh, we're happy with it. But we need to get a little bit better. I need to get a little bit better. We'll go out here and hopefully go win. But it's definitely a positive from last last two Phoenixes for me. You must feel that win is coming soon. I mean, yeah, but you got to work for it. Appreciate your time. What does this do? Um, knowing that this is the championship race, if you guys were to get here, knowing that you were one of the top guys today. Yeah, I, I felt really good early in the run, but just in that middle section, we just struggled really bad. Uh, but we got to figure it out, and we had a great strategy, great strategy call by my, my crew chief. So uh, we just, just got to get a little bit better, but I think we're we kind of know where we need to get better at. How did your car differ between when you were in clean air when you were leading early versus in those middle stages of the race? Yeah, uh, definitely it's just it's just really hard to drive in early air, especially this track and the way the nature of this car is. Uh, you know, I really don't feel like it was a big difference with the uh, way the fuser change was. It's just the nature of how it is. This is Austin Dillon, driver of the Bass Pro Shop Chevrolet. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also check out one of those two videos beside me. Visit frontstretch.com for more racing content.